All right, let's talk thermostats. Um, I'm redoing my cooling system, and I'm replacing the thermostat. Uh, now, there's a great deal of debate about whether you should use a low temperature thermostat on your Porsche. Uh, and a lot of people uh, are switching over to a 71 degree thermostat, where uh, it came with an 83 degree thermostat from the factory. Uh, now, uh, a lot of debate on this, but I decided to go with the 83 degree thermostat. Um, and uh, the reason for that is basically the type of car. So, rehashing the arguments. Um, the position of the thermostat and the distance of the radiators, uh, some say, make it necessary for a low temperature thermostat that will open up sooner and give you a little bit more breathing room as far as the temperature of the engine. Um, kind of makes sense. Uh, the problem with this whole theory is that the people who switch to a low temperature thermostat don't change the temperature on which the fans in the front of the radiator switch on. Uh, so the thermostat may be opening sooner, but eventually the coolant is still heating up to the same temperature uh, before the fans switch on and, and cool it down. Um, so it might take slightly longer, but the end result seems to be the same in my mind. Um, the uh, only like hard evidence I can find about a low temperature thermostat, like a really exhaustive uh, study on it, uh, was from a, a bunch of people who uh, were rebuilding engines and saw a lot of failures with engines and started to use 71 degree thermostats on them. However, that article specifically referenced newer Porsches. Um, I have a 986. Uh, the 986 and the 996, uh, in other words, the Boxster and the 911 um, from late 90s, early 2000s, those cars had a different designed head gasket that would feed coolant at different rates to each of the cylinders. The next generation of Porsches, the 997 and 987, I believe, um, didn't do that. They used the same size holes on the head gasket so that each of the cylinders were getting the same amount of coolant, and that resulted in one cylinder being hotter than the rest. And this particular engine rebuilding company uh, addressed that partly by going to a cooler thermostat. They did a couple of things too. All that is to say, if you have a newer Porsche, the 997 or 987, uh, you might consider uh, a cooler thermostat. Um, my 986, my original 2000 box dress, however, uh, doesn't have the same design. Uh, so I don't think that that applies, and I'm going to use the original thermostat. It's also worth pointing out that my Porsche probably has the original thermostat on it, the 83 degree one, and it's got 90,000 miles and it's 16 years old. So uh, it's been working fine all right. Mm, should be good. Um, I'll confirm in a second when I take it off. Yep. 83 degree thermostat, just like I thought. 